Hello and welcome to Sudoku Pro. Hello everyone, this is Uma Maheshwari solving the 5 star Sudoku puzzle from today's Hindi newspaper dated June 1st, 2022. One of my viewers asked me how to start a puzzle. So in this video, I'm going to start by telling you how I'm going to start this puzzle, right? See, as soon as we see these two blocks, which has more numbers, we uh, tend to fill these two blocks. But today, the position of numbers are not favorable and we are not able to uh, place much numbers here. So I'm not going to start with these two blocks. Whenever you have such an arrangement of numbers, there is an excellent clue here because these three numbers blocks these three cells right away. So in this column, you have these two, seven and nine has to take place only in these six cells. So today we have, it is actually very favorable to us and we have three cells left empty where this two, seven and nine can take a place. So let me just write it as a clue here. So two, seven and nine. Uh, in this row, we have uh, two blocking here. So we can write 7, 9 here and then here 2, 7 and 9 goes. So here in, in today's puzzle, we have such arrangement of numbers in two places here and here too. So in both these cases, if you see uh, these 3, 2 and 6 blocks these three cells. Uh, so 3 to 6 will take place in one of these cells, but we already have 2, 6 here. Only 3, then 3 goes in the uh, in these two cells. Since 3 is blocking here, this cell, 3 goes here in C9. Similarly here, out of 7, 6 and 8, 7 and 6 is already there. So 8 goes in one of these two cells. So 8 blocks this cell here. So 8 goes here in G1. There is a 5 here in F row and a 5 here in column 5 blocking these 4 cells. So 5 goes here in E4. This 5 and this 5 here in F row blocks these 2 rows. So 5 goes here in D9. Now in column 9 there are only 3 empty cells and the missing numbers are 1, 8 and 9. There is a 1 and 8 blocking from G row. So G9 takes 9. 1 and 8 goes here. There is a 8 blocking from I row. So I9 takes 1 and H9 takes 8. In column 6, there is 1, 3 and 8 blocking these 3 cells. So 1, 3 and 8 goes in these 3 cells. There is a 3 and 8 in C row blocking this cell. So C5 takes 1 and 3, 8 pair goes in these two cells. In this ninth block, there are only three empty cells and the missing numbers are 4, 5 and 7. There is a 4 and 5 in H row blocking this cell. So H8 takes 7 and 4, 5 pair goes in these two cells. Now this 7 blocks this cell. Um, actually in this block there are only 3 empty cells and the missing numbers are 1, 7 and 9. So this 7 here blocks uh, this cell. So 7 goes in one of these two cells. Uh, but you have a 7 here in column 2 and a 7 here in column 1 blocking these two cells and 7 goes in these two cells. Now uh, we know this now 7 is uh, blocking D row and E row. So 7 has to be obviously here only. 7 cannot be here and here. So 7 goes here in F7. And now uh, there are two empty cells and the missing numbers are 1 and 9. Let's mark it with 1, 9 matching pair. In this fourth block, the missing numbers are 1, 4, 7 and 9. There is a 4, 7 pair blocking this cell. 
So this cell takes 1, 9. That makes a matching pair for uh, this 1, 9 here in F8. Uh, so now in F row, there are only 2 empty cells and the missing numbers are 4 and 6. Let's mark it with 4, 6 pair here. There is a 3, 5 pair here in column 2 blocking this, this column and there is a 3, 5 pair in H row blocking this cell. So 3 and 5 goes here in G3 and I3. Uh, here there is a 9 in column 5 blocking these two cells. That means 9 can go in only these two cells. Uh, so this 9 blocks this 9. So we can eliminate 9 here. And we have a 7 here in H row, so we can eliminate 7 also. So we have a 2 here, this 2 blocks this cell and there is a 2 here in 4th block blocking these 2 cells and there is a 2 here in A row blocking this cell. So 2 goes here in C3. This 2 cancels out the 2 here. So this becomes a 7-9 matching pair. Uh, this 8 blocks this cell. So 8 goes here. And the only missing number in this block is 2. This 8 cancels out the 8 here. So A5 takes 3 and B4 takes 8. There is a 4 here in A row and a 4 here in column 1 blocking these 3 cells. So 4 goes here in B2. There is a 3 here in A row and a 3 here in C row blocking these uh, 3 cells. So 3 goes here in B1. Now in B row there are only 2, uh, so there are uh, 3, uh, there are 3 empty cells and the missing numbers are 1, 2 and 5. There is 1 and 2 blocking from here. So B6 takes 5. Now the missing numbers are 1 and 2. There is a 2 blocking from here. So uh, B8 takes 1 and B7 takes 2. Now this 1 cancels out the 1 here. So F8 takes 9. Uh, E7 takes 1 and F1 takes 9. Now in this fourth block, there are three empty cells and the missing numbers are 4, 7 and 9. There is a 4 and 7 blocking from column 2. So D2 takes 9. Um, now the missing numbers are 4 and 7. There is a 4 blocking from here. So E3 takes 7 and D3 takes 4. Uh, this 7 ca cancels out the 7 here in E6. So E6 takes 9 and D6 takes 7. In column 6, there are two empty cells and the missing numbers are 4 and 6. There is a 4 blocking from A row. So, A6 takes 6 and C6 takes 4. Now, here in column 7, the missing numbers are 6 and 9. There is a 6 here. So, A7 takes 9 and C7 takes 6. Here in column 8, the missing numbers are 5 and 8. There is 8 blocking from here. So, C8 takes 5 and A8 takes 8. Now, in 0, the only missing number is 9. In A row, the missing numbers are 1 and 5. There is a 1 blocking from one column 1. So, A1 takes 5 and A3 takes 1. Now in column 2, the missing numbers are 1, 2 and 6. There is a 1 and 2 blocking from G row. So G2 takes 6. There is a 2 blocking from H row. So H2 takes 1 and I2 takes 2. In this block, the only missing number is 9. Now in H row, the only missing number is 6. Now this 6 cancels out the 6 here in F4. So F4 takes 4 and F5 takes 6. 
Now in column 5, the missing numbers are 4 and 7. There is a 7 blocking from I row. So, I5 takes 4 and G5 takes 7. Here, the missing numbers are 3 and 9. There is a 9 blocking from G row. So, G4 takes 3 and I4 takes 9. Now, this 3 cancels out the 3 here. So, G3 takes 5 and I3 takes 3. And now, G7 takes 4 and I7 takes 5. And the puzzle is solved. How did you find the puzzle today? Please share your experience in the comment box. Thank you and have a nice day.